It currently applies to businesses in retail, three million and over, but the proposal would change that to all business categories, two million over at ten cents per one hundred. The machinery and tool tools tax is essentially zero per one hundred, and as proposed, be changed to twenty cents per one hundred at assessed value in this budget. The proposed budget also includes the addition of a vehicle license fund so that could go up two point four two percent, and the amount was five hundred seventy-seven thousand. Over half. And then if you add in the general fund, which is 29%, general fund and the electric fund make up 93% of the overall budget for the town of tax. So this actually includes items such as business license tax, meals tax, sales tax, crazy, occupancy tax, etc. The next largest category is state and federal aid, which includes items such as the tax relief from the state, highway maintenance funding, house bill 599 funding, and fire treatment. That comprises 24% of our overall budget. Then the third largest category is general property taxes. And this is probably the one we thought was number one, and that's real estate and personal property taxes. They make up 23% of the overall budget. This is actually a very comforting thing to see. You don't want to see all of your revenue stream dependent on one type of revenue. So seeing several different categories breaking out is very billing and current commercial charges. So what we are getting in the last quarter, what would that look like continued over the next year? And if we look at the expenditure side of it, what is the breakout? How are we spending that money? So 56% of it is spent on refuse disposal, 27% is spent on refuse collection, and the administration is percent of it is spent on refuse disposal, 27% is spent on refuse collection, and the administration is 7%, non-departmental is 65% of the total budget. The next highest is non-departmental at 14%, followed by supervision and engineering at 9%. Current plan adopted by council, and it includes a 30% spread from a minimum grade to the maximum of grade. We have received feedback that we need to expand the range to remain competitive with our neighbors and to provide room for growth with existing employees. So the proposed plan over to the right raises that scale of 1% on the minimum but it also increases the spread from the minimum to the maximum from 30% to 49%. So it provides a larger scale range on those divisions. So the first one is the cost to hire a building official. Then the second one listed here is the cost savings by freezing the assistant public works director position. The next one is the cost to add one full-time animal control officer, or really any officer is that cost right there. And then a part-time position for firefighting in two years 25, we do have 1.6 million included in this plan. And you can see that it escalates up through 26, 27, 28, and 16. We'll have public hearing and adoption of tax rates on April 23rd. We will have presentation of the town manager's proposed budget again to council on May 9th. We will have a public hearing on the proposed budget on May 14th, and we will have a council adoption of the fiscal year 25 budget. Hopefully, May 28th. However, that can always be pushed to the first or second.